What's up guys? Welcome to Comic Basics, where we explore the comic book origins of your favorite characters in three minutes or less. I'm Joel, and today's character, Red Wolf. Before we begin, I'm going to ask you to do something for me. I need you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button right below this video. Not only does it ensure that you don't miss a video, it also helps this channel grow. There have been numerous heroes to take on the mantle of Red Wolf. For the purpose of this origin, we will be discussing William Talltree. The son of the Cheyenne tribal leader Thomas Talltrees and Rebecca Talltrees, William was born at Wolf Point, Montana. From a young age, William grew up learning of stories of the Great Red Wolf. At one point, William's family was forced into selling his property to corrupt businessman Cornelius Van Lunt. Tragically, shortly after this transpired, Van Lunt ordered the murder of William's parents. Enraged, William vowed to get his revenge and avenge the death of those he loved. To do this, he began wearing the ceremonial wardrobe of the Red Wolf. Wearing the costume, however, wasn't enough. But Wei Odata, the one responsible for empowering the Red Wolf, does exactly this and empowers William with its abilities. William then finds a wolf cub, who he names Lobo, and begins to train it as his companion. With his wolf and newly granted powers in tow, William follows Van Lunt to New York where, with the help of the Avengers, he gets his revenge. The Red Wolf possesses just a few powers. He is an experienced archer, a top tier marksman, and possesses above normal combat ability. Further to that, due to a way of data, he does have superhuman strength. And that's it guys, the Red Wolf in 3 minutes or less. As always, I'm going to ask you three things before you go. First, if you like this video, hit that subscribe button. It really helps this channel grow. Second, if you really liked it, be sure to check out our other videos. If you don't know where to begin, no worries. I've given you a recommendation up in the right-hand corner. Third, I'm going to ask you to check out two websites. First, I need you to go check out something we really believe in. It's called Comics for Cause, and you can find it at www.comicsforcause.com. The link is in the description below. Comics for Cause is a not-for-profit organization created by S-Tier Comic Basics that sees the distribution of comic books to hospitals and orphanages all over the world to children who need them most. Check out the website, and if you can, I encourage you to help us. Second, I need you to check out Comic Basics, of course. Comic Basics is the parent company to this YouTube channel, and it has more information that we can cram into any of these videos. You can find it at www.comicbasics.com. The link is also in the description. Thanks, guys. We will catch you next time.